Hey guys, it's Crypto Me Analysis coming at you with an update video on inverse finance. So this is to Majid Ali Khan. Hopefully I said that right. Um, so yeah, let's do an update on inverse finance. 14 million market cap. What the heck happened to this? Is this still on Coinbase? Yeah, it is on Coinbase. Okay. Um, inverse finance. This thing actually released on Coinbase at like $700. That's crazy. So it's just consolidating right now. From the high to the low, nothing's bullish about inverse finance until we get over $57. And on the short term, it needs to, so it has resistance basically everywhere. So in the short term, we need to get over 33 and to $40. That is all resistance. So don't get overly bullish if all of a sudden it goes up. Clearly you can see it spiked up and came back down, spiked up and get back down. This is all resistance for inverse finance. As far as support go, it looks like if this floor doesn't hold for whatever reason, the next area of support for inverse finance is gonna be $10. And that's gonna mark an all time low. So clearly you can see that this floor right here absolutely needs to hold, which is what we're holding on to. And if it doesn't, then we are gonna go much lower and capitulate. So that's what I see with inverse finance. It's not looking too solid right now, but um, I mean, this could be the bottom and we could move back up. Like from here to here, it did, it did almost a yeah, 3X and then it gave it all back. So then it went back down, yeah, 75%. So. It might have floored it. We might have double bottomed because we're not like in this channel anymore. So clearly you can see we're in this like channel and then now we're not. So we could be bottomed, but just be aware that the next area of support is $10. I hope all of that made sense. Please like, subscribe, comment. Thank you so much for your support. None of this is financial advice and I'll catch you guys in the next video.